Do you think that your mental diet is affirmation and affirming all day long? If you have done your mental diet and actually you are exhausted and now you're confused, what should I do to manifest? Welcome to my channel, my name is Neya and over here we take manifestation and the law of assumption and all the laws of the universe and we make manifestation easy, fast and effortless because I'm a Taurus and I'm very lazy and I want shit done today. So guys, welcome to my channel for those of you who are new and now let's talk about mental diet because I don't think I have ever done a video around this plus I just created a video for my patreon because over there not only we do challenges but I do give more and more information about the law and manifestation and I also share much more my private life and my personal experiences because everything that I say over here is different from other people and comes directly from my experiments and my experience and today I reiterate the topic of thought transmission and I explained why your mental diet is essential and why your thoughts create according to science because we do possess a something wonderful that shapes reality which is not just your self-concept but it's the morphic field of resonance go ahead on my patreon to watch the video to know more about the science behind the law of assumption you do not have to know the science if you're not interested but it helps out with not struggling or fighting with your logical mind when resistance is built. However, for the purpose of this video, let's be simple. Let's talk about the mental diet. Mental diet, initially for, for beginners in the law of assumption, people think is about affirmation and affirming all day or it is about affirming specifically for their self-concept or for their specific desires or specific person affirmation is a very powerful tool i love affirmation completely agree with people that do promote affirmations it works you don't need to do anything apart from affirming i 100 percent agree however i am as you know very lazy and i love effortless manifestation and i personally don't believe that you have to affirm all day but actually if you have been in this community for a while you already understand that sometimes you just affirm once and it just shows up in your reality and manifestation is fun easy and indeed effortless and you can manifest anything even out of thin air so anybody that tells you that you have to put discipline or effort and it's hard it's they, they don't know what they're talking about they don't understand what an assumption is so Essentially, what a mental diet is, is not affirming all day, but it's actually something natural because as I always like to say, you are a manifestation machine. You are a genius at manifestation. You have always done this throughout your life and it's the most natural thing that you can possibly do. Now, I do understand that some people like me are more visual people. Some other people, they think a lot, therefore affirmation are totally their cup of tea. Some other people are empath and they are very sensitive and they like to feel things very deeply I have a video on patreon where I teach you where I teach you where I explain you guys how to understand what is the best method for you to manifest however let's talk essentially about thoughts because at the end of the day it does not matter whether you see in picture or whether you feel or whether you affirm only you actually think all the time so that's the root of everything the first hermetic principle mentalism everything is consciousness everything is mind as neville said the pearl of great price you gotta buy the pearl of great price and the pearl of great price is nothing but your thoughts create so mental diet is not affirming all day your mental diet is essentially awareness which is very spiritual in and of itself so what is awareness awareness is the understanding that you are not your thoughts you are not your body you are a spiritual being having a human experience or if you don't like the spiritual terminology you are the observer the observer of what the observer of your 3d reality and the observer of your thoughts and you can direct your thoughts at any single moment and point in time because you live in a constant and eternal now and i explained this in my webinar about science how your higher self lives in the fourth dimension and has is all knowing when it comes down to your past present and future because it all exists at the same time and this is why creation is finished however topic for another video being consistent with this video let's say that your thoughts create and you are the observer and you can direct your thoughts at any single time your thoughts create through the morphic field because they push out in your reality however 
People freak out when they understand this because they think, oh my god, my negative thoughts are gonna create, my old story is gonna push out, I'm gonna have the purge, and what if I have a negative thought and this is gonna create? Chill out. First of all, this entire idea of the purge, I will make a separate video, is bullshit. Your old thoughts don't create because you exist in an eternal now. Your old thoughts will create only if you allow it to be because you decide to believe in something called the purge or you decide to believe in something called birds before land. I believe in birds before land because I like to believe in birds before land and I find it fun but I can decide at any moment in time that that is no longer my belief system. What is a belief? A belief is only a thought that you keep thinking and you keep repeating. That's why affirmations are powerful, because affirmation create belief, because it's only thought that you keep repeating all day. However, you do not need to exhaust yourself, because repetition doesn't have to be affirmation all day and exhaustion necessarily. Repetition could only be, I'm aware of my thoughts, essentially, in the now. The present moment is the only thing that you have. So you don't worry about what is, because the now is within you, as within, so without. So you observe naturally, you, you do this naturally. You observe the movements of your thoughts. So you wake up in the day, you, you, you try a little bit to think about the version of you that has what you want. Yes, it's a little bit of effort, but it's not. Like, you have to take it as a game, as something fun to do. It's like pl play, playing pretend, you know, like kids do. I'm so happy, I have, a, I have an amazing boyfriend, and I have an amazing career, without looking too much about what it is. And then when, through, when you go throughout your day, you just keep the awareness of your thoughts. So what are you thinking? Sometimes you might think about silly things, such as your makeup, or I want to go to the grocery and buy this. Go naturally with those thoughts. You don't have to block these thoughts. These are perfectly fine. Some other times you will think about your desire and you will think about your specific person or your specific career or money. When you think about this, let's say that a negative thought pops in, say, no, I reject it and you direct as the observer your thoughts where you want them to be that is mental diet and the more you will repeat the awareness of your thoughts and the direction of your thoughts where you want them to be like you're shooting an arrow the more the morphe field of resonance which is only but an energy field around you will push out the hologram and you do this every day in the internal now and so that's why your all thoughts don't have to create because you can literally decide right now through your mental diet I am deciding right now that this is my reality and because I am deciding right now this is my reality it will push out it will push out and let's say that if you can do this this will be great let's say that you make a decision and you don't contradict it or never think about it ever again you will push out super fast because there is no contradiction but let's say from some from some desires you can't do it fine don't freak out just try to be natural about it Instead of affirming, affirming, affirming all day, take affirmation from websites or YouTube channels or Instagram, create your own affirmation that sound natural to you. So every time that you will naturally think about your specific person or naturally think about your desire, you might say, I'll think about it all day. Well, if you think about it all day, you'll think about it all day. You'll, you do it all day, but you do it in a natural way. Not because you're forcing yourself. Every, uh, every time that you will think naturally about your desire, you can do an affirmation or you can naturally think thoughts that are in alignment with your wish fulfilled. And by doing this, your thoughts will naturally create a state of, of feeling. A feeling that is supernatural, you won't even notice. And because of that, they will push out and arrive to your specific person or create your own reality. So what is a mental diet? The mental diet is nothing but awareness of the movement of your thoughts. And it's easy. It takes a little bit of practice because you think a lot of thoughts and most of them are subconscious, but don't worry about the subconscious thoughts because they're not that important as people would think that they are. Your conscious mind imprints the subconscious mind. So right now, erase everything that you thought about it in the past, just focus every single day in the present moment and in the present moment think thoughts that are in alignment with your desire naturally naturally means you go on about your day naturally and when you naturally think about your specific desire you think thoughts that are in alignment with the wish fulfilled that's it if you pay attention 
with a little to no effort to your mental diet and make decisions that are rooted in the present moment through your consciousness, your manifestation will be easy, fast and effortless always and you can and if you do this with a little bit of concentration and focus even in three days or in less than 24 hours i have videos about this you can manifest everything that you want truly okay guys so i hope this video made sense and made some clarity around what is a mental diet and how to use a mental diet to manifest check my patreon for extra videos i also have an e-course on how to manifest a specific person with my formula effortlessly and i see you very soon on this channel bye guys